Another Trump associate has been raided, but it was not by the government It uh, or Bob Mueller. Trump's former uh, doctor, Harold Bornstein, the guy who said that Trump was the healthiest person ever to walk the planet, uh, also said to the New York Times that he took Propecia. It turns out a few days later, he was raided by certain individuals. Here is his description of the events. Let's take a look. What exactly were they looking for? All his medical records, his pictures, anything they could find. We must have been here for 25 or 30 minutes. We created a lot of chaos. I couldn't believe anybody was making a big deal about a drug that's to grow, to grow his hair, which seemed to be so important. And it certainly is not a breach of medical trust to tell somebody they take Propecia to grow their hair. What's the matter with that? What is the matter with that? He looks like Steven Spielberg's puppet older brother. <laughs> well, he, does, he doesn't need Propecia. This guy has lots of hair. This guy, yeah. he overdosed on Propecia. <laughs> <laughs> Propecia is just like he secretes it from a gland. You know, the lesson learned for this guy and anyone else who supports Trump is that he is not as loyal as he says he is. He's he not loyal. At all. At all. At all. At all. And it's only a matter of time when he turns on you. I mean, he's turning on Michael Cohen, his yep. longtime personal lawyer. Yep. So, uh, you know, all of the, all of you who are in bed with Trump, your day will come when he turns on you too. Yeah. yeah. The, the, per, the people who raided this guy's stash of Trump files uh, were Trump's bodyguard, Keith Schiller, uh, and his a lawyer with the Trump Organization, and a third man that came to the office, according to reports. Uh, it happened on February 13th, 2017. What is the justification given by the White House in response? Well, White House Press Secretary Sarah Huckabee Sanders called it standard operating procedure for the White House Medical Unit to obtain a newly president, newly elected president's medical rector, records. Uh, that was what was taking place, is those records were being transferred over the White House Medical Unit as requested. Do you buy I it? Have, I have switched doctors in the past. And usually I don't send my bodyguard and lawyer to get the records. You just call them and go, can you please send the records to this new doctor's office? So no, Sarah, again, lying again. And Michelle Wolf did a good job coming after you. You're lying, lying, lying. Two easy ways to follow the Young Turks. One is hit the subscribe button down below. Uh, then you're a TYT subscriber. And second is ring the bell. And when you do that on YouTube, you're notified of our videos.